hey you guys what's up it's your girl Crete. welcome back to another video so in today's video i'm going to be bringing you my first impressions of the daisy love mark jacobs pop i know you guys have seen this all over the internet this is their most recent release if you are interested in seeing my thoughts then definitely continue to watch uh, daisy love mark jacobs pop this is the one called love pop they also have two others in the collection which i did try them in store they didn't really speak to me as much so i did go ahead and go with this one um and of course this is limited edition this is a 50 mil this has 1.6 fluid ounces and yeah here we go so you guys see the packaging it's really nothing special here is this beauty right here and I understand that some people really don't like this packaging y'all know how I feel about packaging I mean it really doesn't bother me however I think this is pretty cute I do I think it's nice and girly and fitting for how it smells so we're gonna get into that so first things first let me give you guys the notes the top notes are cloudberry accord raspberry accord bergamot accord um in the mid notes we have pistachio accord chantilly accord and daisy tree petal and then in the base we have benzoin driftwood accord so first things first the appearance i really like how it looks i think it's cute um it looks just like the Daisy Love Uso Sweet, which you guys know I have and love. Oh, yeah. Let's get so, into it. I'm going to take this off. And there you go. And I'm going to show you how it's spraying out. Sprays just fine. Mm, okay. I'm going to spray it somewhere. I'm actually going to spray it in the cap, and then I'll spray it here on my shoulder. Because <laughs> I've already been spraying stuff today, y'all. So... Mm, it smells really good. So I'm just going to give it some time to settle down. But our first impressions, you guys, I'm getting a really nice, like a fresh type of scent. It's very airy. I'm definitely getting, you know, the cloudberry. I'm not really familiar with that, but I do know that that is in the original Daisy Love which this does smell similar to in my opinion you get a little bit of that raspberry you definitely get the opening of bergamot you know i got this fragrance what really stood out to me was obviously that chantilly cream who doesn't love a nice creamy fragrance uh i do think it's creamy i even get a little bit of that driftwood in the base what I was looking for was that pistachio. I really was looking for that accord because I really, I've been digging the nutty smells, the nutty fragrances lately. And I must say, I'm not really picking it up. I really am not. Um, as much as I want to like this fragrance, I mean, I, let me take that back. I do like this fragrance, but do I need to add it to my collection? No, no, I don't. If you have Daisy, love do you need this i don't think so because i'm not picking up that pistachio personally i would say get your nose on it first before you just go ahead and blind buy to see if it's different enough that you feel like you need it but i don't think it is and i did want to compare it to daisy love uso sweet which i recently did empty you guys i've been loving that fragrance so much lately and i repurchased from a discount site you know i got a tester bottle so that's why i don't have the top on y'all but don't even worry about that because the juice still smells the same <laughs> mm. you guys you know this one has my heart and it's for half the price um and this is a 3.3 you know and this is limited edition which always gets people right because it's limited edition you want to get your hands on it um i would say test it out but personally i feel like if you have this I wouldn't get this. This isn't even sweeter than this. Um, uh, and I just love, I love this one, you guys. And um, just for reference, this one has raspberry as well. It does not have that cloudberry. Um, it, they both have bergamot. This one has blackberry in there. And then also it has daisy and musk. You know, hands down, I like this better. And since I just bought this, absolutely do not need this. And 
I'm going to be returning it to the store. Um, if you don't have any of the Daisy Loves and you want to try out one and you were already thinking about getting one, then I would say that maybe you should try this out. Get your nose on it first. Don't blind buy it. Definitely go try it out and see which one you want. But um, personally, I'm going to stick with this. I'm happy with it. And yeah, but I do think it's a very pretty fragrance. I did not pick up the pistachio like I wanted to. It's fresh. It's airy as well. I think that pretty much goes for all of Marc Jacobs' fragrances. Um, pretty airy, fresh, some sweeter than others. Hence, this is sweeter than that. But yeah, you guys, uh, those are my thoughts. I'm not going to hold you too long. If you guys are interested in that fragrance, I definitely think you should go in the store and get your nose on it first. Just to avoid having to return it like I'm about to do. <laughs> but yeah, um, if you guys want to see any other reviews from me or if you have any thoughts or questions or concerns definitely leave it down below and i will see you guys in my next video don't forget to like the video and subscribe for more content bye